Hi, Vampers Kiss here. Angel is uh, at a Christmas party inside this building right now with David. This is called the High Noon. I'm not sure how well my camera's doing. I have Jamie as my sidekick. See on the roof there, those bags? Those are called luminarias. Oh, look at that, on cue! Isn't that better? Yeah, <laughs> way better, thank you. I couldn't have asked for a better video. Thank you very much. Yes, that was very nice. Yeah, see, isn't that cool? That's a, I guess, a, I don't know if it's a New Mexican or a Mexican tradition, but they do it. They actually have a tour that people um, buy tickets to, and they oh, see. the candy lady. Oh, there's the candy lady. Just a minute, let me finish Sorry. my statement about the. Yeah. Anyway, the tickets sell out in like 30 minutes, and you can't even, you don't even have Let's a chance. Have. Yeah, really close. Okay, now I want to mention something about this. This is the candy lady. Now, the candy lady, when we used to have Breaking Bad filming here, I, I think she still makes it. Yeah, it's, she does. it's meth candy, she called it. And it's not really expensive, but it's the color of the meth that uh, Walter White used to make. And uh, she kind of, uh, she was already famous before that, but she became even more famous from doing that. And of course, she became a favorite of the cast, too, because of doing that. So, this is um, basically our old town. Um, not a lot of lights on down here. I'm sorry about that. But I thought that I would just, it was, we're kind of early too. I told Jamie, I think I want to um, come down here before it gets too dark because I didn't bring a flashlight. Does that sound familiar? Any of you watched our uh, Halloween video? <laughs> She's always blaming me. Yeah, okay. Well, we never get down to Old Town very often because um, it's Albuquerque. Albuquerque. Yeah, it's Albuquerque. I guess that's the best way to put it. It's Albuquerque, and I hate going to Albuquerque because it's a scary place to come to. But there's, I mean, it it's well worth the visit if you're visiting Albuquerque. I mean, if you live here. What'd you say? I said just don't leave your car. Yeah, just don't leave your car. Bring your car with you everywhere you go. Anyway, um, they've got like these little uh, like alleyways. Kind of reminds me of like in Vegas. They have these little alcove things. But this is like, you know, old town, obviously. They don't have things like that in, uh, what do you call it? In like Tombstone. I don't know. What, how... How old is the city of uh, Albuquerque? Is it like 200 years old or something? It's pretty, yeah, I thought it was like the 200th anniversary or something. Anyway, it's, you know, it's pretty... See, there's another one of those little uh, alcove things. And they've got like little shops down there. A lot of traffic. A lot of people coming to parties, I suppose. But, um, yeah, you definitely can't say it doesn't have its appeal down here because it, yeah, it definitely does. But they have a, a square down here. I'm not sure what they call the square. Court, I want to say, I was going to say Courthouse Square, but that would have been a Portland flashback. See, there's another little alleyway they've got there where there's um, shops back in there. Something for everybody. A definite tourist trap. And I guess once a month, um, there's a group that comes down here. I'm not sure what they're called, but they do reenactments. And they probably do them down here in the square. And, you know, that might be exactly what that's called is Old Town Square. Where? Old Town Square, maybe that's exactly what that's called. I don't know, but there's somebody that's really all out for Christmas there. It's probably the Christmas decorate. Uh, what, the Christmas ornament store. And isn't it called Pioneer Square in Portland? Guess what I said. I had a flashback from Portland. Uh, 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 yeah, it's kind of, this is kind of like my uh, Tombstone oh, video, except in Tombstone they didn't have as much uh, lights to be able to look at. Oh, we're coming down to the square now. 
There's supposed to be a tree, uh, yeah, a tree down here, I think, because they had the tree lighting ceremony last night. But, what? Oh, great. Um, that building right there with the luminarias on top, I have a little story about that. I'm not sure how old the building is or anything, but inside the building, there's an actual tree growing in the building. Is that the one? Yeah, that's the one. And uh, you can actually sit in the room where the tree is coming through. Yeah, we've been there. Yeah, we've been there. It was cool. It was worth it. Yeah. And this is the, the square. Here's, um, you know, I didn't do my research. I don't know. That's a church, obviously. But there's the... That's not the tree then. That's not the tree then? I don't think so. Oh, please, don't tell me this is the tree. No, it was blue last night. I mean, is that what they did it? I mean, this isn't even really... That's the tree. Oh, and look, there's a little polar bear in there and a tree and some... Another little bear. Well, I wonder if my... Like, that's why I do video. Anyway, I don't know if you can see this. There's a cannon. I didn't even actually know that they had these down here, the cannons. I don't think you can see it. Have to come down here during the day to see it. They do little events inside that gazebo. I've never been to any of the events, to be honest with you, because I'm definitely afraid of crowds. I'm always afraid something's going to happen. But David and I were down here one night walking around. It was practically desolate. And I got some really nice pictures of this church here. This church has been here a long, long time. I'm not sure how long, but didn't do my research. But let's just take in the beauty of it. It's pretty, huh? I think it's very pretty. So there's the... The tree, I guess, that I don't know if that's a permanent tree or or if that's a tree that they brought in. Is it a permanent tree or a tree they brought in, Jamie? Do you know? I think it's permanent. Really? They actually have a tree that big here, huh? I think so. I don't know. Wow. Well, shock, shock, shock. You know, the, these buildings right here, I know, I'm not sure what they are, but I imagine them have been bordellos in the day because you see how that it's got the uh it's got the street. the uh what do you call it i want to call it a veranda but that's not the right name like the porch on the outside where the horse could have like uh been enticing the men to come Isn't that a veranda? Yeah, another... oh is that a veranda could be anyway the tree is purple i don't know if you could tell that I have to say, I kind of like that way better than the tombstone, which was white or clear lights or whatever you want to call it. So, yeah, I don't know how much closer I can get because the camera's gonna. There's this, oh, there's a snowman. This is all kind of cool in here. See, I totally envision this as been being like a huge whorehouse. <laughs> they have luminarias up on top too. I'm not sure what it was. There's the tree. Has the star up on top. Totally cool. 